Hello and welcome back to my channel. This is That Geeky Gal and my name is Gracie. Welcome back to day three of 12 days of Harry Potter Christmas. For today's ornament, I'm gonna be showing you how to make this simple clay platform nine and three quarters ornament. As always, please remember to subscribe and links will always be down in the description box below. Okay, first thing you're gonna need is some air dry clay. This is called like a scoring um, utensil a pencil, a sharpie, a white marker, uh, paint marker, some scissors, clear Mod Podge, a piece of white cardstock paper, some twine, something to make a circle with. Okay, you're gonna need a brush, white acrylic paint. You're also gonna need maroon colored acrylic paint, but I don't have any. So I'm gonna show you how to make maroon color using red, blue, and yellow acrylic paint. So let me show you how to do that first. The first thing you're gonna need is you're gonna need a, some red and a tiny bit of blue acrylic paint. I'm using Red Apple by um, Apple Barrel and I'm using, I believe it's called um, Royal Blue. And you mix it up. Now if you know your color wheel, you know that blue and red make purple. And I'm gonna add a little bit more of some red and yellow to warm it up a bit. You mix that up and you get the perfect Harry Potter maroon color. Okay, so let's get started. I'm gonna put down a little bit of parchment paper just to um, protect my surface, and I'm using the Crayola air dry clay that I've used before. I'm gonna roll it up and smooth it and knead it. Once it's all nice and smooth and kneaded, I'm just gonna make it into a, a little bit of a flat um, ornament is what I'm trying to go for. And I'm using a cup to be able to smooth it out. I don't have a roller. I think it's time for me to roll it. I'm using the same cup as my guide to cut out my circle for my ornament. And with that scoring um, utensil, I don't know what it's called guys, you can see it. I'm just cleaning up my edges. Once my edges are nice and cleaned up, I'm using the other side of that tool to go ahead and make a circle hole actually for our twine. Now I'm using this platform nine and three quarters that I saw on Pinterest as my guide. I'm gonna be using um, some white acrylic paint now that it's nice and dry. It took me about a day for this to dry. It's been a little bit cold here in Cali, so of course it took me a while for it to dry. And I'm just gonna go ahead and give it a nice layer of white paint. And once that's dry, you wanna make sure and give it two good coats. All right, so now with my pencil, I'm gonna grab something that's like circular. Um, when I did the video, I actually got, it's like a medicine bottle to make my template of a circle. Now let me show you what I originally did. I originally had painted the circle black and used maroon color and for like on the inner side. And I originally made my ornament looking like this. I'm not happy with it, you guys, so that's okay. With crafts, you can always redo it over. So instead of painting a black border, I went ahead and painted my border all maroon colored and the inside white. I used this template, and if you remember, or if you've seen my Stranger Things um, video, I went ahead and traced with my phone the nine and three quarters. Now, using another circle, I went ahead and made a circle around the nine and three quarters. I erased my pencil marking, and I used a black Sharpie now to outline and to fill in the number nine and then the three quarters. I did it because no matter how good of a free um, hand writer I am, I just couldn't get the Roman numerals to come out perfectly, and this way I made sure it was perfect. And symmetrical, of course. Okay, here it is all finished and now it's all cut out. So now that I have it all cut out, what I'm gonna go ahead and do is, it's gonna go in the middle of my ornament. I'm gonna grab some Mod Podge and lay a nice coat of it on first. And then I'm gonna grab my paper and stick that onto my ornament, to my clay. And then on top of that, I'm gonna coat the whole ornament in glossy Mod Podge. 
you can actually use glossy, you can use matte, whatever you like best. I have glossy and I'm going to use what I have laying around. <laughs> Honestly, for any type of craft, use whatever you have laying around your house. And here it is, nice and dry. Alright, so I'm going to grab this white paint marker. And with this paint marker, I'm going to go ahead and write inside um, the ornament, where it's the maroon color. I'm going to write the words Hogwarts on the bottom and on the top platform. And you can write whatever you want. You can write, um, I believe the original one has platform 9 3 quarters Hogwarts Express. But I wasn't sure if the Express was going to show up. So I decided just to go with Hogwarts. Okay, so now it's nice and dry. I'm going to use my Sharpie to make a little bit of an outline. Right where um, I have the paper. And there it is. I think it looked a little bit better that way. And then, simple as that, you're just going to grab your twine, loop it through, double knot it at the end. And here it is! My platform 9 and 3 quarters themed Hogwarts ornament. I hope you enjoyed today's video. I hope you'll stick around for more. Please subscribe, it really helps out my small little channel. Like this, share it with anyone, and I'll see you guys tomorrow in the next one. Thanks you guys, bye!